People in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living and a retirement for having. But in my case, I'm just looking for my love. I want you to know, my love, that as long as you stay where you are, as long as you remove yourself in the way you have by changing a last name in a lie, the Lord cannot honor you. You need to reinstate your old name. You asked me what name to remove, I told you. But that wasn't for you to put on a fictitious name to place yourself in more jeopardy. What you need to do right now is to get in that vehicle of yours, pack up yourself, your two boys, and come right directly to me. I've been saying this now for almost three weeks. You sort of did it, but you didn't stop to talk to me. And that is the challenge that you're facing. That as long as you play with those police officers, you will always be at risk. But when you're with me, my life protects your life to eternity and beyond. If you don't believe me, get out your pendulum, my love, and check. You know that you are the one who taught me everything in that realm. You know that you are the one that changed my life for God. You also know that you changed my life for you to come back into my life at this time. And it's time for you to come and handle this situation. It's time for you to become everything that the Lord has asked you to become in the way that you know he's asked you to become it. You need to start listening to that loving, small voice in your brain that says it's time to be with him again. And openly, you know that it will protect your life with mine. The same with the boys. I will shield you, I will comfort you, and I will love you all the days that remain for you. It's time now for you to do what I say. It's time now for you to submit to God in every single way. It's time now for you to submit yourself in front of that tool that you taught me in my school, in my home, as I looked across at you, leaning against my whiteboard. Do you remember that area? You were legitimately leaning against that when you showed me the tool. I was seated somewhere near my stairs and my shoeboxes, and I asked the Lord two questions. I know that in your soul you knew what those questions were, and you legitimately knew the answer. It's time, my love, for you to come and be with me. Thanks for listening.